allegiance but to self. Kill or be killed. You know this. Of course. One will be consumed and become something greater than either. This is the heritage of the Zerg. It's a very depressing Fear. heritage, is it not? No mercy. Oh. Fight. Do you guys know what the Zerg need to do yet? Well, if you don't, let me tell you. They need to adapt and consume and evolve. Now you know. God damn, great epiphanies all around. Oh wow, oh shit. Okay. Oh god. Our conquest continues. No, 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 no. Well, at least he's nice and smashes his own guys from time to time. Slay them all. Feel the wrath of the right. No time like the present. Oh. Make your peace. It's also nice of him to stop spawning ultralisks. Sooner or later, we'll wound him. Well, I think we're just content right off to the side here. You're in my way. You force my hand. The swarm conquers. No denying reason. No escaping purpose, because without purpose, we cease to exist. Oh crap. Zervin, you traitorous bastard. Zerus is mine. Isha, prepare the Leviathan. It's time the swarm returned to the Kapru sector.
You know, I'm, I'm really confused as to where the story's going. I it can't... All, all of a sudden there's Primal Zerg that we need to kill for no seemingly no reason besides to make Kerrigan Zergy again and become more powerful. My queen, I have been contacted by Kalisa, a broodmother. She has heard of your accomplishments and wishes to return her brood to the swarm. Her brood is small in number, but it has strong leviathans. Kalisa, hear me. The planet Mistef 4 is a hub of Dominion military production. Take your brood there and destroy it. Do that and you will earn your place within the swarm. It shall be as you say, my queen. My queen, your transformation has altered your abilities. If you wish, you can review the changes within your chamber. Did you know the Ancient One would turn on me? Your essence. It called him. And you didn't try to warn me. He was Zerg. You are Zerg. One dies, and one grows strong. You know. I think I'm starting to understand you, Daga. He's not exactly a complicated dude. It is a good sign that some of your brood mothers are returning to the fold. I wonder why they are willing to give up their independence. Perhaps not all of them wish to rule the swarm. And perhaps they know there is safety in numbers. There is no other creature like you in the swarm. Where did your essence come from? The Overmind spun me from many species, a brood of one. What did you do after the Overmind died? Wandered the tunnels of Char without purpose. Pharaoh, Queen of Blades, found me, made me Zerg again. You aren't Zerg unless you're under someone's control. Without overriding will, am beast less. So the Zerg want to be controlled. They want to be in service to the swarm. I get it. They don't need anything like agency or free will or individualism. Strain, ready for augmentation. Expeditionary brood discovered ancient Zerg essence in Dominion space. Brood under attack. Limited time. Did you guys know that Hydralis sacrificed toughness for a powerful ranged attack? Protect them with roaches or zerglings. I know this is geared for like people who've never played StarCraft before, but... Uh, I don't know. They always, they always make, they always amuse me for some reason. Not entirely sure why. They just kind of do. But I'm excited for evolution missions. I like evolution missions. Planet Merrick Five, Swarm Hive Cluster under assault. Nearby, Overmind creation, Impaler colony, slow attack, incredible damage. Collect essence, adapt hydralisks, defeat Dominion. Good old sunken colonies. These aren't just feral zerg. These are enraged feral zergs. Examining sequence incomplete. Must kill remaining impaler colonies. They're sunken colonies, god damn it, Abathur. Get it right.
got to dance around him. Rock on. Sequence acquired. Spinning impaler essence into hydralisk morph. Hydralisks now able to morph into impalers. Okay. Well. I guess we'll see what they are in like 15 seconds. Hmm. Impaler attacks while burrowed, damages single target, tears through armor. Well, Something just busted out of the ground. you remind me an awful lot of a unit unit that I used to know. Now you're just a mutant that I used to know. I don't know how the song really goes. Also, I've got no tune. I've got no tuning abilities. Can't carry a tune. That's it. Rock on. Apparently, I also lack knowledge of cliches. This par those poor fire bats. Man, why did not we even put marines in the bunker? Why did it have to be fire bats? Then we could have actually shot them. Barricades destroyed. Only Prometheus Company base remains. Go get him, Zerglings. Well, at least Abathur was able to speed up that horrendously slow sunken colony attack. So they do 20 damage normally, then plus 45 versus armor. Terran forces eliminated. Alternative Hydralisk morph possible. Surviving lurker dens discovered. Oh, well. Speaking of a unit that we used to know. Planet Caver, once birthing colony for Dagoth's brood, now feral. I remember Dagoth. What a man. Or should I say giant sentient worm. Feral lurkers, survivors of interswarm conflict. I can control them, but I can't morph more. Key transformation sequence missing. Requires Lurker Den. Secure nearby Den. Return essence to swarm control. Ooh. The Feral Zerg sensed us. Oops. Burrow, quickly. Lurker. Attacks many foes while burrowed. Effective against light enemies. Jesus. More feral zerg. Burrow quickly and attack. That's a good job, feral zerg. Just charge straight into the lurker spines. Good one. Destination reached. Broodmother Kilisa inbound to extract essence. Overlords en route. I sense the feral zerg moving. They're attacking from the south. Defend the lurker den. Oh, this will be a successful attack. Another wave incoming. Keep them off the lurker den. 
they do a really good job of putting him in like the number one situations where they'd be most effective to like really show them off. Jesus, what a slaughterhouse. In fact, I would say that that was terrible, terrible damage. Feral Zerg defeated. Broodmother ready to extract essence. Must prepare sequences for Hydralisk Morph. Returning to Evolution Pit. Hydralisk Morph ready for integration. Await decision. Well. It's a tough choice. Because the Impaler has longer, longer range. But they can only attack the one unit. Making them probably more... Uh, more effective offense units whereas I think these would be more effective defense units so I'm gonna go with the lurker in the end I can gonna go I'm gonna go with the unit that I used to know Evolution it's a safe bet god now I can't get that stupid song out of my head of the primal pack leaders has awakened a new column and many abilities as new tiers of abilities continue to awaken you will gain abilities in this third column as well oh man i definitely want automated extractors no question about that also wouldn't mind what do i want i'll switch for psionic shift i like kinetic blast better but I'm definitely going to keep spawn banelings. Twin drones. Malignant creep. Your units and structures gain increased uh, life regeneration and increased attack speed on creep. Mm. And creep tumors to spread creep 30% faster. Twin drones. It's also... I think I'm going to go with twin, twin drones. The... No additional supply cost is what sold me. All right, let's get out of here. The Terrans launched thousands of these devices at our broods on Char. Broodmother Kalisa relayed this to us. It is not a weapon. It's a two-way communicator. The Queen of Blades. I knew you'd return to your true form. A monster. Now, you'll do exactly as I tell you if you care at all about Jim Rayner. <laughs> yes. He's alive. Well, who called it? So you'll keep your swarm away from Paul and away from me, or he dies. That man sacrificed everything to give you back your humanity, and you threw it away. <laughs> How he must be disgusted by you. Why, he'd be first in line to kill you. Yeah, that was kind of a bitch move, Kerrigan. I can't sense Jim out there. If he is alive. Nothing in this universe will stop me from finding him. All right, Dominion Space. At your orders, we will move our Leviathan into Dominion Space and begin searching for the Terran ship Hyperion. You wish their help in finding the Terran Jim Rayner. One of our broodmothers in the Caprulu sector is picking up a strange psionic signal. It is Zerg, but not part of the swarm. I know you seek to topple Mengsk. His alien soldiers, the hybrid, are your greatest threat. If you wish to stop them, meet me at these coordinates. If the Dominion is controlling hybrid, our invasion of Korhal will fail. This lab must be destroyed. Well, 
there's only one character that I can recall in the StarCraft universe that has a Russian accent. And that would be Tavaj Alexis Alexei Stukov from the United Earth Defense Force, which who died uh, in Brood War. So I don't really know why he'd be alive or why he'd be back, but it could be interesting. But I'm also really interested in seeing the reunion of uh, Kerrigan with her bestest buddies in the Hyperion. So both of these are intriguing to me. But uh, I'm going to go with the Hyperion first. Valerian, we're picking up some kind of reading. Warning. Psionic waveform detected. Scale. Unclassifiable. Kerrigan. What happened to you? How? There's no time. Listen carefully. Jim is alive and I can't find him. But you can. Hack the Dominion network and figure out where they're holding him. How can we trust her? Valerian. If there's even a chance that Jim is alive. I'm going after him. Hacking the Dominion security network will prove difficult. Only one man can hack that network. Colonel Orlin. And he's being held prisoner by... Mira Han. The mercenary leader. Isn't she a friend of yours? Not exactly. It's complicated. Let's just get this done. Find him, Matt. We both owe it to him. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess I'm playing as the Terrans now. Good old Dahaka. Why are you so obsessed with collecting essence? It will mean survival. Because new essence makes you powerful? Power will be a trap. The Buck leaders fell to this. If it's not power, what is it you get from Essence? Essence is change. Change is survival. Collect and live. Stay still and die. My understanding of vision must be incomplete. Why do you say that? Because I see no strategic advantage to this location. There is no essence to absorb, no enemies to conquer. Yet I know that you possess vision, and your actions always have an underlying purpose. My reasons for being here are my own. It is your right to keep the truth from me, my queen. But I will try to find it anyway. Go ahead and try, Zagara. I'm pretty sure this one is outside your understanding. Damn it, Abathur. Why can't you teach the Zerg to love? We have arrived in Dominion space. Should we move on the Dominion research facility? Not yet. I have to deal with something first. Will this give us some special advantage, my queen? Should Abathur be ready for new essence? Silence, Isha. This is a personal matter. It will end badly, but I must see it through. Is it possible for the Swarm to hack into the Dominion's network? Terran systems inelegant. Problem with interchange. Many factors obstruct request. Biology. Language. So our thoughts are too different for anything beyond simple transmissions. Accurate. Zerg processes complex. Incompatible with Terran machinery. Then it's up to Valerian now. Rock on, Valerian. To hack the Dominion's restricted network, we need the best decryption expert out there. Colonel Orlin. Unfortunately, he's being held captive by Mira Han, one of the meanest and craziest mercenary leaders alive. Help. Guess we had to meet back up with Mira eventually. Actually, no, we didn't. 
he's one of the least important characters. And so was Colonel Orland from the last game. Just be trotting him out. Because that's... Can't get enough of Mira Han, man. Sounds like we're playing as the Hyperion for this mission. Mira Han, this is Prince Valerian. Do you read me? Of course I do, Princess. I know you're working with Matthew. Put him on, please. You forget yourself, mercenary. Hello, Mira. Matthew, you never write, you never call. It's almost like you don't care. I'm here to ask for your help. You've got Colonel Orlin and we need him. He's the only man who can hack the Dominion's deep encryption network. Well, I'd love to help. I just need the permission of James Raynor. Jim's not here right now. Oh, dear. Then I'm afraid I cannot give you Colonel Orlin. Look, Mira. We need Orlin to rescue Jim. Just hand him over. A mercenary's reputation is all that she has, darling. I will not relinquish my prisoner to anyone but the client. Not even to someone with your devilish good looks and brooding intensity. Sorry. We could destroy her operations in this asteroid field. That will get her attention. We'll have to cripple her prime space station. She won't make it easy for us. We need to set up our own base. And one of Mira's fleet stations is nearby. We can take them out and set up our own station. Oh, I like where this is going. Course laid in. Bring her around. Keep your eyes open. Make it so. Let's show them what Make this boat so. can do. Sensors are showing the location of Mira's station now. We might as well get started. Coordinates locked. Hey kids, the asteroids ahead are too dense to navigate. You'll have to do a short range jump to get past them. Keep your eyes open. Jump on my mark. Mark. Nice. Those short jumps are good for getting out of danger too. Confirmed. Course laid in. Bring her around. Easy thrusters. Make it so. Primary laser battery does eight damage. Doesn't say how many batteries we have though. Got a fighter patrol nearby. Too many for our main guns to take on all at once. But we can launch a sortie of our own tag fighters. That'll even the odds. Right. Well, <laughs> scramble nice all vipers. Yes, we away. Coordinates locked. Engage target. Confirmed. Make it so. I'm liking this mission already. I think this is pretty damn cool. Scramble all vipers! Nice and easy. Keep your eyes open. Those ordnance towers have long-range attacks that deal a lot of damage. Fortunately, our long-range Yamato cannon deals even more. Give her a spin on that oh, tower. Crap. Coordinates locked. Easy thrusters. Keep your eyes open. That's a repair bot. If we grab it, I can instantly repair the Hyperion and replace lost TAC fighters. Make it so. All squads away, Hyperion. Engage on target. Got a beat on it. Confirmed. Course laid in. Target acquired. Man, that ordnance tower just demolishes We're under heavy fire our here. fighters. So you gotta wait until it's done recharging. Nice Beauty. Nice work. We can salvage this base and have it start manufacturing automated fighters for us. Every time it puts a fleet together, it'll send them against Mira's guys. Can we just discuss this with her? It doesn't work that way out here, Valerian. We need a mission to, to play through. We hey, need a story. Mag mines. Those babies pack a punch. They come at you in a straight line, so you can dodge them, or even use jump to get out of their way. 
Not necessarily a story, more of an excuse to fight. Bring her around. Mineral fields. We can harvest these for more resources. Get those minerals and I can upgrade the Hyperion. Make her even tougher. Okay, looks like there's a large... Sensors show dense clusters of minerals nearby, but they're guarded by mag mines. Man, that... Make it so. That was a really tough, uh... Easy thrusters. Keep your eyes open. Barry to overcome there. Sensors indicate we gathered all the minerals in this area. Is that a Valkyrie? Nice and easy. Coordinates locked. Nice and easy. Let's show them what this boat can do. Keep your eyes open. Oh no, that might have been a Valkyrie. Make it so. 